All right, good evening, everyone. Um, this is FSD Beta 11.4.7. I drove using this version this morning and actually didn't see a single thing that was improved um, as far as FSD goes. Okay, right here it needs to speed way up because this uh, merge lane is very short. It did a good merge, but I had to hit the accelerator. Um, as you can see, it's a very short merge lane. And into the shoulder. Car follows construction line into the shoulder. So um, that is not fixed. But one thing I did notice was that the cameras were much clearer and color accurate. So, I wanted to go out tonight and test the flashing yellow lights because one of the things I noticed with the flashing yellow lights is sometimes it would display a flashing red light on the screen. And um, I think what might be happening is every once in a while it thinks that yellow, that certain shade of yellow of these lights, is red. But if the colors are more accurate, and I know that the, um, all right, so I didn't see any headlights coming toward me, so I didn't disengage there, but you could see that it went in the middle. Um, so anyway, I know that what the car sees is different from what the, what's shown to us, but I still wonder if, if there's some color inaccuracy that came into play and, um, if this might fix it. So we'll see how it goes. Um, all right, so normally it's been stopping correctly right up here at the road edge, which, wow, that was, that was a pretty bad turn there. And look, I'm halfway through the turn and there it goes. Uh, and that was super jerky. I mean, if there was any traffic around, that would be unacceptable. Um, so yeah, as far as FSD goes, there is no improvement there. I mean, I really don't think this version was meant to be an improvement. I think it was more um, a way to get everyone on to the same version. And hopefully we'll get our main branch software up to date with public non-FSD which is way far ahead of us right now. But anyway, I've shown this before, but my town at um, 11 p.m. switches all the lights to flashing yellow, or if you're on a side road, it would be flashing red for you. But through going through town, it's all flashing yellow. So as you can see, the, the camera view is super bright and clear now and this was all done with software i've got the old the old lights um you can see just on this turn signal it still has the light bleed uh but the whole thing isn't orange like it used to be it, i mean i can see details way back in the distance now that i could never see before um so that gives me a lot more confidence in the cameras um for Hardware 3. I know I've said in the past I don't think Hardware 3 was 
going to be good enough as far as the cameras, um, but maybe I'm wrong. So, oh. So that's my fault. I, um, I need to close this. I need to remove this stop. So, yeah, what? I totally forgot. I, I've got to remove waypoints. So, um, again, yeah, it, so it rerouted. Um, so here we are, flashing yellow. Uh, no, it's still showing every once in a while. It shows it as a red on the screen. So hard braking right there. See it? See how it's showing red? Um, yeah, that. I thought maybe this would fix that, but it hasn't. So again, we'll see this light here. It's flashing yellow, and we're coming to a stop. Stopping for traffic light. It's showing red now. So it's not red. Um, yeah, unfortunately, still a problem. And I'm going to edit my trip and remove the next stop. So I'm hitting the accelerator again. So it's taking a long time to reroute. So, unfortunately, that is not fixed. It is still seeing those as red sometimes. So here we are again, another flashing yellow light. And it's coming to a stop. It's showing red on the screen, stopping for traffic light. So I'm hitting the accelerator to get us through. There is a car coming up behind us, and I don't want the car to just stop in the middle of the road. So here we've got red on the left and yellow in front of us in our lane, and it's showing it every once in a while as red. So it is totally confused on the colors. Um, not sure why it's clearly yellow. It's a very gold, yellowy yellow. It is not red at all. So it's stopping and said stopping for traffic light. So I hit the accelerator again, and here we go. So got two more flashing yellow lights coming up. Oh, there's no one behind me now, so I'm gonna just let it stop. If it stops. Nope, this one it's not. Uh, and it just flashed as red as we were going under it. And my sunglasses just fell into the console. All right, last one. It's showing red on screen every once in a while. And stopping for traffic light. It shouldn't stop, but it is. It's showing it red on screen. Again, it's it's totally confused. So, there we go. So, totally not fixed. And I, even though, so I'll just bring up the cameras again. The cameras look great. And I'm not sure, let's see, I'll save footage.
So I'll grab the footage off of the dash cam and just see what that looks like on the forward-facing camera at those lights. Um, but obviously the car is rendering those as red sometimes. So here we go, turn at the wall, and very good, speeds up a little too much, it should max out at about 15 on this road, and it should not stop here, this is just a 90 degree turn in the road, um, but yeah, there we go. Um, I'll just close this again. I will remove this stop. Wish it was an easier way to do that. And we got one more turn toward the school. Stopped way early. So the light bleed still sucks, but at least the rest of the view is clear. And yeah, another spot speeds way too much. Um, speed limit technically is 30 unless it's a school time, but this spot is so narrow, curvy, and downhill, and the houses are so close to the road don't want to be going really fast through there. You're an absolute jerk if you do that. So, there we have it. Uh, you know, just the most of the drive was pretty much like normal, um, but yeah, the flashing lights aren't fixed, but the cameras look great, so I'll take it. Um, it's not worse than the last version, 11.4.6, but it's not better. Um, but the cameras are better. So, I guess you have to count every little win you can get. Alright, thanks a lot for watching, I'll see you on the next one.